holla at ya, I've got some stunts. Hi, I'm Ali Plum and I'm here to guide you through the iconic moments that have inspired stuntman Damien Walters in his breathtaking The Evolution of Stunts. Let's kick things off with Safety Last. Harold Lloyd is up there with Buster Keaton and Charlie Chaplin and what makes him even more impressive is that in 1919, someone handed him what he thought was a prop bomb. He lit it with his cigarette and he lost his right thumb and his right index finger. So when he's hanging off this clock face, he's doing it using only eight fingers. Well, seven and a thumb. Next, we have an iconic scene from Buster Keaton that was shot in 1928. This is two tons in weight, and he's got to stand so that the window just goes over him. How did he do it? It's a nail in the ground. That's what Buster Keaton used as his mark. In Damien's homage, he's actually rolling down a conveyor belt as he hits his mark. If he had put a nail in there, that probably would have really hurt his head. Number three on the list, it's a good old fashioned bar brawl by Errol Flynn in 1939, Dodge City. In Damien's interpretation, what he did was practice at at half speed, so that when you get up to the actual real life fighting, no one gets hurt. The master of suspense himself, Alfred Hitchcock, wanted to make sure that when his lead character in North by Northwest was being shot at, it wasn't some cliched alley, cue crop duster in the desert. To achieve the effect he wanted, Hitchcock used 61 camera angles. Damien, however, uses just one. When I say to you, Raiders of the Lost Ark stunt, you're probably thinking of the big boulder. But Damien assures me this over and under and round maneuver with a truck is much more technically challenging. Everyone knows the bike chase sequence in Terminator 2 Judgment Day, but what you might not know is that the guy who played T-1000 went on a rigorous training regime so it never looked like he was busting a sweat when he was chasing after that Honda motorbike. In The Matrix, Carrie Ann Moss, who plays Trinity, actually twisted her ankle in one of the early scenes, but decided not to tell anybody because she didn't want to be recast. 300 is renowned amongst the stunt community for its slow-mo tracking shots in its fight sequences, and that's something Damien was really keen to pay homage to in his tribute. What better way to end our love letter to stunts than by setting Damien on fire. The first full body burn happened in 1951 for the movie The Thing from Another World, where a man wore a totally asbestos suit with an oxygen tank underneath. That's the end of my guide to the movies that inspired the evolution of stunts. And if you haven't seen it yet, it's available to watch right now. Thanks for watching. Lots of love. Bye bye.